I wasn't going to talk about it because I, I don't really care about the Grammys, but I wanted to, uh, y why not? You know, let, let's, let's just watch the video. I haven't watched it. I, I, I know kind of the rundown of what he says, but Harry Styles won album of the year, uh, for his recent record, Harry's house, which I did like. Quite a few songs off of. I still listen to a few. As it was, probably my favorite song he's ever made, which may or may not sound normy. Uh, one of my favorite songs of last year as well, especially in the more mainstream area of things. However, I think not only were a lot of people robbed for Album of the Year nominations, but I do, my opinion, Harry Styles fans, I, don't worry, I'm not mad that he won it. I really don't care about the Grammys. I just saw this on my YouTube as I was setting up stream. So I wanted to bring it up because... You know, I like talking about music. Uh, but I do think, you know, a Kendrick, definitely a Beyonce, uh, even an Adele, I feel like would have probably been my choices over Harry's house. So that's just my two cents on it. I didn't really, you know, I wasn't really tripping anyways. I don't watch the Grammys. I just saw it trending and I was like, oh, Harry won. Uh, seem, seems fitting, you know. I, I kind of assumed out of everyone it'd be like, I actually thought it would be Beyonce. I thought it'd be a Beyonce and Adele, maybe Harry. That's actually what I thought. I didn't think, I actually didn't think Harry was going to win for sure though, but it was one of my main guesses. I thought there was no way Kendrick won, even though I wish he won, because he definitely deserves it, and he definitely deserved it for the Pimp a Butterfly. But he definitely still deserved it. But it's fine, because Beyonce's record, you know, it should have won, but I'm not mad. I'm not, like, I'm not, I'm not either side, because I feel like this video is going to make people think that I'm a salty Beyonce fan. I really don't care. I just found it funny. And what I also found funny is Harry's wording when he accepted the, the award. Let's just let's just watch it and I'll, I'll tell you what I'm saying. And the Grammy goes to... You can read it. Harry Styles! Woo! Let's go! Spending all that time in Harry's house was worth it. My favorite house on the block. Woo! Hey, Lizzo. Didn't she win record of the year? That's pretty cool. Even if her record wasn't her greatest either. I still like a lot of songs up this record though. I'm, like, I'm not mad at it. And you know what? His drip is is actually kind of not as bad as normal so uh, extra points for that. i really sound like a hater i swear i'm not i'm just a guy that tells jokes man don't get mad at me <laughs> god damn okay i'm skipping this i just wanted to get to what he said i don't know where it's at though i haven't watched the whole speech shit that's awesome. He starts with shit. I, you know what? I, you gotta applaud him for that. Ah, um, oh, damn. That's exactly how I, I would accept the word, too. I'd be like, well, be, maybe be a little worse. I'd be like, well, fuck. We done did it. God damn. Um, <laughs> you need to leave. I've been so, so inspired by every artist in this category with me at W. A lot of different. Kendrick? Kendrick inspired Harry Styles? Yo, someone needs to edit Harry Styles singing over, like, <laughs> over you or Wesley's theory. Like, one of those crazy, crazy beats. Or, like, this dick ain't free that beat. We need, we need the edit. Sometimes Streets I, need it. I listen to everyone in this category when I'm alone and, um. Or a Bad Bunny one, because Bad Bunny was in this category as well, wasn't he? Obviously, so important for us. I think Lizzo was too. There is no such or was he? I don't think fair, fair. Sit in the studio thinking, making decisions. Yo, get the fuck away from me! What stupid fucking? I'm not talking to Harry, guys. YouTube. I'm literally just talking to this random bot in my chat. I'm going to get rid of them. I don't remember how to get rid of people from chat, but I'm gonna try. How do I do this? I don't know how to do this, bruh. I don't. I don't know how to do this. Bam. That's how you do it. There we go. I banned them. And I've accidentally pinned something. I pinned something on accident. What did I just pin? Oh, I pinned a Spotify track. Okay. Okay. Let's get back. <laughs> Based on what 
is going to get us one of these. This is really, really kind. I'm so, so grateful. I'm going to pass it over to my collaborators who are, I'm just so. Uh, yeah, nice. This doesn't happen to people like me very often, and this is so. Now, wait a minute. Before, I see the Harry Styles fans typing. I get it. Twitter's been beating your ass lately for that sentence, and y'all just been defending your mans. Your mans. I get it. I get it. I get it. However, let's just take a step back, all fandomness aside. That just... You gotta realize that he could have picked better wording. It's not often someone likes me, like me wins something like this, or some like what he said. And... Look, I, I get what he meant because I, I, I read the Twitter shit. I saw the stylers, you know, uh, the, the defending their man and going hard, right? Because I, I saw it, you know, I'd I, I be reading Twitter beef just because, why not? It's funny. And I get it. It was because, like, he's a, a more normal dude. Uh, grew up, I guess, poor or something, right? And, you know, he's just not, I don't know, something like that. Cool. Fair enough. Fair enough. But you got to realize when you say something like that very vaguely, People's minds could go towards a, a bit of a, you know, a lot of white people, a lot of straight white people have won these before. Because that's what people will think. I'm not saying that's what I thought. I'm just saying you got to realize, Harry Styles fans, that's why you, you got you to gotta just realize people are going to think that. So, look, man, don't, don't, don't get mad at me. I'm just the messenger. I'm just trying to bridge the gap between the fandoms and let the truth be known. I did find it kind of funny though, cause that like let's be real, that wording is kind of not the greatest. It's not the greatest, but it's fine. It's fine. Congrats to Harry. I just wanted to, you know, I, I just thought it was a little crazy. Hey, Queen. Damn, my wording was ass this whole time too. I'm skipping. I sound like I was trying to rap rap god unsuccessfully. Also, I want to say um, hello back home to my daughter, Luna, and my son, Fox. Turtle power. Woo! Oh, I'll let it finish. I'll let it finish. I feel so grateful for this um, opportunity. And uh, I think right now I'm just going to say that, you know, it's so hard to do anything in life without a good family. And I just want to thank my mom and my dad and my brother who are here. And, it, it, you know, you can't do this without them. And one of them w. Crazy, I love you. And uh, my whole team, Nathaniel, Francois, everyone, thank you so much. This is impossible without you. And of course, Harry, you're... I know some fucking Harry Styles fans are going to get mad at me. Bro, I rock with Harry. I like Harry. I like his music. I listen to it. I be trying to get people onto it. Damn. I'm just... I was just saying. Uh, but yeah. Uh, shout out you two. You guys are funny. I can't wait till the...